what is leeway space of nans assalamu alaikum let us see that today there is a time in our life when deciduous teeth is going to be replaced by the permanent teeth so in this case the deciduous canine and the deciduous molar will be replaced by the permanent canine and the premolars and this is called the second transitional phase now here you can see the deciduous teeth occupy a larger space compared to that of the permanent teeth which are you know inside the jawbone so when these permanent teeth they erupt there will be some space extra left so this extra amount of space is called the leeway space of nans and this is greater in the mandibular arch compared to the maxillary arch in the maxillary arch we have 1.8 mm that is 0.9 mm on each side while in the lower one we have 3.4 mm of space that is 1.7 mm on each side now what is the significance of leeway space of nans this space is utilized by this molar right here to drift mesially so this molar will drift mesially and will help establish the class 1 molar relationship hence our mandibular molar utilizes this space to move mesially and establish this class 1 molar relationship <coughs> I hope you found this video helpful if yes let me know in the comment section below do leave a like and subscribe to my channel see you